or the serious gamer. Hey, it's Spider-Man, NextGenTactics.com. This is Search and Destroy Rush series for Rundown Offense. This is my class, the Killstreak Layout. If I'm not using this, I Prestige or whatever. You know, it's Search pretty damn close to that. Oh, Just in case you see something different and you're wondering, hey, that's not the class he showed us at the beginning. So this is... Our B side rush. I don't do it that often, and just exactly for that reason, because you'll run into guys on the bridge occasionally if they're rushing from the other side. And we actually had a pretty decent tactic. We jumped off, hit under the bridge, and he jumped down after us, and we smoked him from behind. So that was actually pretty good. And we we like to do these these rushes across the bridges. I mean, we do most of them down the middle. And you hardly ever run into anybody going down the middle for some reason. Guys like to go to A side or B side, they never like to cover off the middle. And seriously, defensive strategies. You've got, what, basically four ways in. I mean, essentially three ways in. I mean, you have the stairs on B side as well, but you can cover that with, you know, it's sort of the same, the bridge on B side and the stairs on B side. So you basically, you know, offense has three ways in, and... Defense can get set up so easily to cover those three bridges, and I don't understand it. Like, I don't know. Anyways, I mean, once we do our clan strategies for uh, six-man team strategies, uh, I think uh, I think we won't lose on rundown defense very often. Okay. So this is a middle rush to be. Now this middle rush is amazing. Guys, never cover it. Hardly ever. You can run into A, you can run into B. Guys going to the buildings, I mean, seriously, I just made a B line. Hey, a B line to B. And I'm planting, right? And I didn't see anybody, didn't run into anybody, and I don't know why I still have the bomb. <laughs> so, and now I'm defending. I'm defending the, the bomb, right? But those rushes are just so easy sometimes. So we're just going to sit in here. And you don't want to go out. I mean, they're all going to be sort of converging, or sh you know, the enemy team should be converging on B. So you don't want to be you don't want to be out in the open. Um, I mean, there's only one guy left now, obviously, but at the time, right after we planted, we didn't want to be out in the open. Okay, so here's a middle rush to A. This is my favorite, just because you can flank guys easier. I mean, if you if you go up here and try to flank guys at B, they're there are too many spots they can go into. They can go into the buildings or whatever. I mean, they're, they're harder to find. On A side, you can easily flank them. You can easily find them and find them and destroy them. Just like I did there. And there's a sniper here. We don't actually kill him, but we get an assist. We should have had a kill. God damn it. Anyways. Yeah, so here's another middle rush to A. I, and I love the rush. I love it. I just love it. It's fun. And... Oh, there's somebody. Oh, there's another guy. Oh, we didn't finish this guy off. Oh, we did. Oh, and there's a knife. See, I mean, you can catch guys so easily. They're rushing to that... They're rushing to that bridge at A. And they're not, you know, they're not covering that middle bridge at all. And it just baffles my mind why nobody ever covers that middle bridge. And you'll actually see an attempt in a, in a round coming up where actually one of our teammates is on, our clanmates is on one, on the enemy team. And he's expecting me to do the middle rush, but just not expecting it as fast as I do it. But we'll see that in a second. Here's another B-side rush. And I will always, always jump over, like rush and jump over uh, the railing on the bridge down into the creek. Um, because if you try to go over to the bridge, I mean, guys are going to get set up in this building on the second floor. And they'll be able to, they be, they'll be able to catch you coming across that bridge and you know even when you do come up the stairs you just have to be careful as you come up check your right side just in case somebody rushed into that spot and is waiting for you so you know oh, yeah. as you come up the stairs be a little more careful than I'm showing in, in these uh, in these rushes to be okay so we're gonna be looking to plant any second we're just sort of waiting, not sure if there's another guy around here or and what. Oh, and then I fast quick scope. Hello. And there's only one one guy left, so and uh, Claymore gets him. All right. Search and destroy. Destroy. Here's another middle rush to A. Go figure. We got 
So we're doing the uh, the rush day, and there's uh, our clan mate. He tried to get up there on that minigun, and we smoked him. Oh, I'm sorry, killer god. Did I kill you? Did the peeing giant kill you again? <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> Anyways, we get we get that spawn uh, spawn kill. We should have went for a headshot, but whatever. And we got guys lighting up like a Christmas tree over here on our radar. One guy left, I believe, so we're gonna try and plant and get some points because we're still ranking up. We're not, uh, we're not tenth prestige level seventy just yet, and we're not glitching to get there either, guys. And just to show you our integrity and the fact that you know we don't cheat, if anybody on our clan glitches to get to level ten prestige, I think it's patched now anyway, but they would pretty much be off the team or half the. Basically, right, use a new account, like, but you know the fact that they did it would kind of be upsetting. Anyways, sorry, that's off topic. We're just doing our A rush again, and like I said, it's I don't know. I mean, they don't cover the middle bridge, guys. If you're on defense, cover the middle bridge, please. Please, actually, no, don't do it because then I can keep doing this. But I'm sure after you, you guys all see this video, you're never going to be able to do the middle rush on the bridge again because the defense is going to cover it off. We'll see. I don't think we're that popular yet. All right. That it's just going to ruin the rushes that we're showing. Because it'll always work, and you vary it. Again, this is being a rush series. Yeah. You know, if you start getting smoked or get your ass kicked, I mean, don't rush the next time. Play a more, you know, play a more defensive game or a defensive round the next time, right? I mean, again, and that's why these aren't all the same game. I mean, a lot of times when I'm doing my rushes, I'll try to do them. You know, I will do two or three of them in a row just to try and prove them out. To see how effective they are, right? And a lot of times, you know, guys are expecting you on the second time, right? So I'll get killed, I'll get smoked, because they're expecting the exact same rush, and they're defending better against it. But when I'm developing this stuff, I mean, and that's why my kill death ratio isn't, you know, super high, whatever, because we're developing these things, and we try and we keep doing the same thing over and over again just to try and prove it out. You know, how many times in a row can we do the same rush with before, you know, until the enemy knows what the hell's going on and figures it out and, and figures out a good defense for it, right? So, you know, a lot goes into trying out these strategies and trying to figure out which ones work and which ones don't. So we got the bomb plan. I mean, there's five of us. I do like to sit at this position. I plant the claymore on the other side to cover that entrance, and I've got the one beside me, and I can cover off the, uh, the broken uh, wall right there. So I, I do like the spot for defending the uh, the bomb plant. Defending the plant. I don't see any plants, it's just grass. Anyways, haha. -ha. And there we go. So I mean, A is definitely, well, I mean, there's some things to B. And, you know, when I did my rush to B, and one thing I should point out when I planted, always, always plant on your spawn side, because if you have snipers on your team, they can easily get on top of the buildings uh, back across the river and snipe guys who are trying to, to defuse. So always keep that in mind where you're planting on the target, okay? You always, you know, A, there's not much you can do with A. Um, you know, planting, you're better off planting sort of where you're more protected from guys coming into A. Whereas with B, you want to be more aware of where you're planting from a defensive, uh, you know, after the bomb's been planted, you know, where where's the best position to plant to defend against people trying to go and defuse? And it's always at B. It's always, always on the spawn side, like dead middle, if you can, so guys can't sit, you know, lay prone at the side of the target and defuse. Because then your snipers or guys with assault rifles, red dots, or ACOGs, or whatever, who are in the buildings across the road or across the bridge on your side... Um, can sp can snipe guys there or uh, or get guys that are trying to defuse the bomb. So again, here's another uh, a rush through the middle uh, position, and we just keep getting guys like crazy. It's funny. It's like planting claymores on my free for alls. People just keep getting killed and killed, and they never realize or adapt. So the bomb, the guy with the bomb is sort of heading day, it looks like. And we've got like two teammates with him. So we're going to hang out here. 
and try and catch anybody who might be coming over towards A to defuse from B. And we catch a guy here. And uh, that's it. So that's uh, Rundown Offense. Hope you liked it. For more strategies and tactics, visit www.nextgentactics.com. I'm Spiderbite, and I am out.